Hi YouTube, it's me again. I decided to do another phone review. The phone I'm doing today is the Samsung Dart by T-Mobile. Okay. This is a very small phone. It's an upgrade apparently from the back of the phone I have a sticker. From um their LG Optimus and then also their LG, um, it's another phone that they have, I can't think of it, but it's an upgrade. Um, I didn't request this phone, it was sent to me, so this is what I got. I've had this phone now for a couple months and I decided to do a review on it, um, just so you can see how the phone works. Um, this is my home screen. You can add all these different apps and stuff. All these. That's another little thing. Neat thing you can like click. You want to add your Bluetooth or GPS or whatever or Wi-Fi. The phone pad. Very nice. Push button. That's a very nice feature. Um. Your phone book. Very nice as well. Phone book. Alright, the pictures, um, are actually pretty good. They're not that bad. Um, show you guys the pictures here on the phone. Um, and again, like I said, this is just a really quick review of the phone and this little um, application. This is how the pictures come out. They're actually pretty clear as well. The phone is very thin. Um, it's all touchscreen. There is no keyboard. Um, the camera, I don't know the me megapixel for it. Um, overall, I say that the phone is pretty decent, um, you know, as a Android phone, because it is Android through Android. Um, I would say that, you know, if you wanted a kind of inexpensive phone that's, like, really nice, this would be the phone. If you like phones, me in particular, I like phones that have all touchscreen as well as the keyboard with it too um so i mean like again like i said on a scale from one to ten i would give the phone a six so thanks for watching guys 